Welcome to the MSc in High Performance Computing hosted by the School of Mathematics in Trinity College Dublin uh, in close collaboration with the college's research IT division. The course is a full year taught postgraduate program consisting of two semesters of coursework and assessment uh, combined with a substantial project element um, and this video will give you a short introduction to the program uh, describing uh, broadly the educational aims starting with a quick description of what, what uh, HPC actually means. Um, so what is high performance computing? Um, so in many um, scientific and technical domains um, spanning um, well, academic research and uh, modeling of complex systems such as climate modeling and meteorology, um, understanding uh, en industrial and engineering uh, simulations, we would need to solve uh, very large numerical and um, data-driven mathematical models to make uh, detailed, robust predictions about complex systems. And these mathematical models might need to contain a significant level of detail of accuracy uh, to capture a range of dynamical scales from the finest grains uh, all the way up to macroscopic system properties. And then often these models are so complex that um, making predictions um, by solving the mathemat mathematics numerically uh, on a single CPU might take an impractically large amount of computer time. Um, so if we can harness very many compute cores um, using the right mathematical techniques uh, to work on the problem simultaneously, we might be able to get to the level of precision and resolution needed um, for accurate modeling of our complex system. Uh, then similarly, um, modern uh, scientific and computational challenges uh, quite often generate huge data sets. And so finding features in these data sets uh, can prove to be a significant uh, task. And again, the only way to manage these huge data sets is often to use uh, many computer CPUs uh, working together simultaneously. So finding the right mathematical frameworks and implementing them in software to make a uh, large set of compute cores work together, um, connected via a fast network, uh, that's the focus of um, high performance computing. So developments in high performance computing um, closely match the developments in hardware, um, assembling lots of compute cores to make uh, single supercomputer systems. And uh, here's an example, the largest supercomputer in the world, um, which is currently the, uh, the Japanese Fugaku system, uh, based in uh, Kobe in Japan. And it consists of 7.6 million compute cores all working together. You see there in the picture, there's a single rack. Uh, and there are about almost 400 of those um, assembled and connected via a fast network um, to work together simultaneously. And the benchmark speed of the system is uh, 442 petaflops. That's 442 million billion numerical operations per second. Uh, and that's approaching what's called the exascale, um, which is something like a billion billion floating point operations per second by the systems. So to be an HPC expert, to get your master's in high performance computing, you'll learn about uh, mathematical techniques um, for solving large scale problems efficiently uh, on the computer. Uh, you'll learn about the programming techniques um, to use parallel uh, multi-core systems and how to optimize uh, codes to run efficiently um, and to make, to make efficient use of multiple compute cores connected through fast networks. And uh, in order to understand uh, that interplay between the mathematics, the programming, and the, the system hardware, you'll also learn a little bit about some of the features, the key features of modern HPC systems. So that would include sort of processor technology um, and also now GPU uh, technology as well, uh, since that's becoming increasingly important. And then also the networks that can connect these systems together. So the course consists of uh, two components. Um, there's two semesters of um, taught modules, uh, which are continuously assessed and also assessed through written examinations. Um, and then we have uh, 
to get the 60 credits you need to pass the uh, Tor component. There's a selection of compulsory modules and also optional modules as well, which will cover some relevant techniques and topics uh, um, in, in high performance computing, but also in some of the applica application domains. And so you can take uh, postgraduate modules from other schools as well to complement some of the things that you'll learn from the School of Mathematics um, and Research IT uh, division. Um, so once that's completed, then uh, in the uh, summer of your year, uh, there is a significant um, project component as well. And there you're encouraged to work on your own individually with the help of a supervisor on develop developing a, a sort of significant um, software system that will uh, demonstrate that you've learned all of these techniques and exploit a parallel system to solve some large scale, some challenging numerical, uh, technical or scientific problem. Um, and then write a report and present that to us at the end of the year. So that's given you a very brief overview um, of the program. Uh, if you're interested in applying, the college's webpage um, has all the details you need. And if you have some questions for me, uh, I'd be happy to answer them. And my email email address is there on the screen. Uh, so feel free to drop me a line. Uh, thanks for listening.